Usually, we create our design portfolios using some of the websites like Behance, Triple. Sometimes we have a thought on how we can create our own design portfolio website, especially for free. <laughs> I think you have came across or gone through a few of the websites that help you to create your own paid portfolios. Uh, like Squarespace, Semplies, and sometimes Webflow. But in this video, we are going to see a free alternative for creating your own design portfolio website using Notion. Let's get into the video. Before you start to create portfolios with Notion, you have to be ready with few of the things. Let me tell you what are they. There are few must-have assets that you need to be ready with. Number one, banner and logo images. Number two, cover images for different page views. For example, let's say if you're going to create different projects in your website, you have to be ready with cover images for them and high resolution images for your projects. Videos and GIFs if you really need it. Your own picture for about section. You should be ready with your resume and your contact details. What you have to do now is Go to Google, type Notion, you'll be getting a responses notion.so, click on that website, try Notion for free, type your email address or you can sign up with your Gmail, Okay, click on for personal use if you're using for team or not for school, click on that, continue, select it as a designer, sorry design background and then you can select using notion just for myself i'm just giving on my other continue it will directly take you to the workspace where you'll be finding templates click on design portfolio get a template and you can change your cover on like whatever you want say you can either select from galleries or you can just upload the image. I'm going to search some images from Unsplash. Okay, I think this suits for now. You can change the emojis to the one you like. Change it to your name or design portfolio or whatever header you can change. Similarly, it, it can be about yourself. You can type whatever you want. And give the your introduction. to add any of the uh, any other commands that you want to give you can add them there is something available called gallery view where you can give all your projects edit the titles and edit other things as well you can also find uh, other views like table view board view timeline view calendar list and gallery if you want to go with anything else you can maybe uh, check on once so let me take you through the other views you can project your projects by using this views you can delete the view if you don't want it. You have other options to uh, select and you can reposition whatever the image that is there. Or you can change the image if you want. You can delete and upload it new. And then uh, change the title of your project. Let's say if you have uh, done any UX case study, you can give that as, like you have to name that particular case study, what, what it is about. And you can give the link, Behance link or your portfolio link here so that it will directly navigate to your project. Similarly, you have to give your contact details, it can be your mail ID or a phone number and your resume. You can give the link of your resume or you can just upload it. If you want to create new projects, that's also available, you can create them. So what you can do is you can share now. Once you are done with everything, you can share, enable. And then if you want to learn about sharing, you can click on them, see how your uh, permissions and everything is available. In Notion, you can have a look and then share it and see your link expires never and you can give access to few of the people that you're sharing with copy link and try it try sharing it once you share it to web your portfolio then will be available in the website if you don't want to use the regular template maybe you can start your own page create a new page and then start editing your own uh, design portfolio then you can share it in the same way It is very easy to create your own designer portfolio website with Notion. You can try it if you want. Thank you so much. Hope this was helpful. If you have any doubts, please put that in the comment section. Or if you find it helpful, please put that as well. Thank you. I'll meet you all in the next video. Bye-bye.